-hmm. Now, students, let us examine types of germination. We have two types of germination. We have epidil germination and hypogeal germination. We shall start with epigeal germination. This is a type of germination where the cotyledons are brought above the soil level. And during this particular type of germination, the radical grows out through the micropyle and then grows downwards into the soil as a primary root. This diagram shows epigeal germination. Then the part of the embryo between the cotyledon and the radical is known as the hypocotyle. This curves upwards through the soil and protects the delicate shoot tip. Students note this. The hypocotyle then straightens and elongates, carrying it with it the two cotyledons which then turn green and leafy and aid the plant in manufacturing food for the growing seedling. Again, note, the plumule which lies between the two cotyledons begin to grow the first foliage leaves which start manufacturing food. This type of germination occurs in dicotyledonous plants, but some monocotyledonous plants such as onions also have epigeal germination. This diagram illustrates the steps taken during epigeal germination. Now, students, let us examine hypogeal germination.